Look at what I have found here. Something camouflage. Huh. So adventurers, welcome out in nature. Today I want to test a new free camo tent. So let's well, let's go. And here it is. I have never taken it out of this little package, so I'm curious. I hope it's intact and I hope even more is complete. Let's do it like the professionals do. Oh, look at this! It even comes with the original little paperwork. So, it's a more old fashioned style rectangular one. Oh, let's set it up! Oh, now let's do it like the TikTokers do it, you know, like dropping it down and it's just open like. Bam. Huh? I said bam. No, it should now inflate and be fully set up. Seems like the internet is lying to me. Whatever. Let's do it the old fashioned way. Get a bag with ten steaks. Hey! <laughs> they have been in here for a long time. Look at this. How rusty they are. I put all the stuff. It's better you take a bit of orange spray paint or blue spray paint up as best and spray such tent stakes so you have easier time finding them. So we did get two poles. them together like this and keep in mind that's the first time I'm setting this tent up I suppose it goes like this here yeah this actually looks in <laughs> like it's very good okay we have to put the <coughs> poles in here just like this like I said this is the old-fashioned style of tent, not the fancy modern self-inflating TikTok tent. Yeah, let me now rope this all down and then switch the camera back on, otherwise the battery won't last. So. Now, I staked out all the four corners.
So, the last little bit. Okay. Take the pole and put it in here. Set it up. Practice. Put the drop it. <coughs> put it on here. Got nice tension on it. And there we go. You can now see that. Adjust it a bit. We do have these little flaps here on the side, as you see, for ventilation, but we don't have enough stakes. Yeah. We've got those little slightly adjusty things here, I really got to do better stakes than those flimsy ones. We got some ventilation holes on every side. Mosquito net, very important. Get this a bit more here. So we can just zip it up. But yeah. Not bad. For a free tent, and yeah, the camo doesn't really work <laughs> on the green, but if you take it and put it here a bit more into the, the area, yeah, doesn't look bad. Always remember, good tent is like a fancy whorehouse, they say. If you go in, you take off your shoes. And this lighting is really a bit too short to get comfortably in. <laughs> so let's see how I'm doing. <clears throat> Probably one for the sunnies. <sighs> There we go. So oh, now I took you in here with me. It is very comfortable. I can sit upright. Only thing I gotta make something, yeah, something like a loop or something on here, so I can hang my light at night. But so far, here, yeah. it has a lot of room. It needs a bit more stakes to stake it up properly, but I could even bear the head in here. <laughs> oh, it's far long enough for me. Ventilation doesn't work at the moment because I didn't stake it out. I didn't bring any extra rope. <laughs> yeah. Gotta see how weatherproof it is. It probably needs a little spray of something. But yeah, that's the view out here. So, 
So now let me show you how to operate those zippers. Just slide this down here. Take those over here. Uh, trying to get to them. But the camera in the way is not too easy. So there we go. So if it is a bit too hard to close, you just go in a bit more with the stake here. Yeah, nice. And you obviously can stake those flappy things out if you have enough 10 stakes. You can even tie them um, up here. Gave you a little rope. The only thing I have to do is something. I gotta come up with something to hang my light. Maybe I drill a little hole in this post and make a little hook on it. You know, but yeah, this is a good tent. This is an excellent tent. <laughs> you got, yeah, I got room for two, so I could bring a girlfriend if I had one at the moment. Yeah, let's see if I can get out. Yeah, I have to take a bit of a longer rope here. It's just the minimum. It's very comfortable and another thing, uh, keep in mind to check the ground for anything hard because you don't want to uh, be uncomfortable or poke a hole in your tent. Yeah, and here we can see it blends in quite nicely. Obviously sticking a bit out in front of the darker background, but I haven't chosen the position now to be stealthy. It's just a tryout. But yeah. It's a good tent. So yeah, now let's put it back in the bag. And yeah, I will add a few more cords, some tent stakes. I will show you a DIY tent stake video. Very easy. But yeah, that's it, that's it for now. <laughs> So, and there it is now. <coughs> I managed to get it back in the bag. The tent stakes are a bit too long for the bag. But here, the previous owner was not too experienced in packing stuff away. This feels really relaxing. <laughs> 